Hi, my name is Karthik Gopalan. I'm a graduate student at UC Berkeley, and I work under Professor Anna Arias and Professor Michael Lustig. Our lab is focused on making printed electronics and devices. I'm trying to test whether thermoforming can be integrated with printed electronics. Polycarbonate is a hygroscopic material that absorbs water. When you heat it up to a high temperature, you get lots of bubbling and pitting on the surface. So in order to avoid that, we put our polycarbonate in a vacuum oven for three hours at 120 degrees Celsius before extracting all the moisture from the sheet before forming. This is called cap on tape. I'll laser cut this to make a mask. So now I've got the design loaded in the laser cutter software and I'm just going to center it on my plastic sheet. So what I've got here is the Formac logo in the center of two conductive traces. We've got one conductive trace going along the entire outside and one going on the inside, and they're not touching. So in theory, we can place circuits in between the two traces and apply voltages. So I finished coating the samples with conductive ink, and now we're going to take them over to the vacuum former. I've got my sheet here, and our mold is this bowl-shaped object, and I just want to align the mold to, to the printed object. In the past, we've printed on flat plastic sheets that can later be flexed. So now we're just checking for electrical conductivity, the quality of the conductor after vacuum forming. And again with this one. So we're still happy. Even after vacuum forming, our conductive lines are still conductive, which is a good sign. A couple days ago, I made this sample and it has a series of LEDs wired around the perimeter. So now if I connect the ground of my power supply to the circuit and apply four volts, we've got light. This shows that the circuit is conducting all the way through the entire printed trace since every LED lights up. We're gonna continue to develop our research and continue to explore new applications and materials in order to fully integrate printed electronics with vacuum.